Hi, I'm Dr. Alan Weiger from MassageChairRelief.com and today we're going to talk about 3D roller massage. Now 3D roller massage has become all the rage in the massage chair industry. A lot of the chairs are coming out with it now. It's a relatively new feature and uh, it has become something that a lot of people are looking for when they're buying a massage chair. But what is 3D massage? I mean, it sounds cool and people are asking for it. Some people ask for it without even really understanding what it is. Well, if you understand a typical roller, You'll understand that, if, first of all, in physics, there's three axes in physics, three axes of motion, the x-axis, the y-axis, and then the z-axis, which is going straight out from you. x-axis out the side, y-axis is up and down, z-axis is forward. Now, all of those are the three dimensions of motion. It, all massage chairs, pretty much, that have a roller will go up and down, and side to side. So you see the rollers kneading are going up and down in the y-axis and the x-axis. It's going this way out, out in the x-axis and up and down in the y-axis. What we've not had before this mo the, these more recent chairs is the z-axis where the rollers go forward and back. That is what is used to increase the intensity of the rollers. So before, and in, in many chairs still, there's a speed feature which will increase the speed of the up and down and side to side, which feels like you're getting a more intense massage. But if you want to push the rollers forward in the Z axis, the rollers have to have that 3D, 3D capability. And that's what 3D roller massage is. So I'm going to demonstrate the 3D roller massage on this chair. This chair, as you can see, right now I have it doing kneading and tapping. You can see it going back out from out to in on the X axis. And then when it's moving, uh, you can also see it moving up and down in the Y axis. Well, this is this, these rollers are retracted back. Now I'm going to increase the motion in the Z axis. I'm going to make them come out. And with the, with the use of my hands, you'll be able to see the rollers start to move forward. Now watch them. See they're moving forward, moving forward, moving forward. Now see how far forward my hand's moving? Now they're way forward. They've moved about three inches forward from where they were. That is motion in the Z axis. That is what we call 3D roller massage. Now I'm going to retract the rollers again and we're going to see them start to come back into the chair. Now see how they're retracting? Now they're going back into the chair. Now now they're all the way back, and then if I put, you can barely see them moving when the, when the tissue is loose. If I bring them back out again, you'll see them start to come out and poke out, with, even without my hands. See how they're coming out now? Now imagine your back on that, or your neck, or your mid-back, or your shoulders. Now those rollers are working your spine more intensively than they were before. And that is what 3D roller massage is. I hope you found this helpful. If you did, feel free to share it with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, or Google+. And of course, subscribe to our YouTube channel so you can be updated to subsequent videos about definitions or about massage chair features or interviews we do or whatnot. Feel free to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Again, I'm Dr. Alan Widener from MassageChairRelief.com. Thanks for visiting, and we'll see you on the next video. Bye-bye.